I got seven kids and seven baby mamas. Now, for the past few days, I've been going live, telling my story, speaking my truth. And a lot of women having an issue calling me a deadbeat because I tell them I was being irresponsible, yet not wearing protection. But I always tell uh, these women that I got pregnant that I do not want to be a father to these children. And I offer to pay for the abortion. Majority of times, they'll either take the abortion or they'll take a plan B. But only these seven have kept these children. But the crazy thing about it is they want me to be responsible for some children I told them I did not want. So for some years now, some of them been trying to get in contact with me, access denied. Because I, I don't really know why you're trying to get in contact with me. I didn't told you I did not want them kids. So don't expect me to be responsible financially, emotional, spiritually, mentally, or physically with some kids I do not want. And I don't give a fuck what nobody think about it. You're not gonna force children up on me. Yeah, we both made the decision to lay down and have intercourse. We both was irresponsible about the decisions we made that night. Yeah, I could have pulled out, but I didn't. And I ain't care to pull out because I'm not the one that gonna have to carry a baby for nine months. It's the woman. In my opinion, women should be more careful on who they sleep with because you're going to be like one of my baby mamas trying to find me so I can financially support a kid I didn't told her or them I did not want. Another thing is these just jump offs. These are the type of women that I ain't even had to do nothing for. The bad minimum, but they gave me access to their body and they think I want to be a, a father to a child for one of them? Like, I don't even have no type of love for these women. How do they expect me to love these children? Before y'all say, oh, he irresponsible, he a deadbeat, he don't take accountability. Yeah, I do. I just don't give a fuck. You ain't gonna force these children on me when I told you I ain't want them. Yeah, I can offer to a pay for abortion, but at what point can I force a woman to go get an abortion? I cannot. A woman say, my body, my choice, but I say, it's my life my choice before y'all try to stitch this shit and be like black men this black men that i don't give a fuck i really don't i honestly just learned what a vasectomy was three days ago when i started speaking on this shit but when i figure out what that is i'm not doing that shit then they ask him why not wear a condom i have worn protection a lot of time these are just the instance when i have not and unfortunately it has resulted into the woman being pregnant but ask yourself and ask your friends, as a woman, when is the last time that you told a man to put on a condom? Because I have never in my 27 years heard a woman request me to put a condom on. And me being an irresponsible man, knowing that that shit feel better raw, if I'm not going to put a condom on, and if she not going to ask me, it would not be no condom. And another thing, y'all keep saying, I don't think he's telling these women he's not going to be a father after he have sex and accidentally get them pregnant. Do that shit even matter? Do I have to tell a woman to be responsible for her body? Do I have to tell a woman to wait for a man to commit to her before she have unprotected sex with him? Or do I have to tell a woman, wait till marriage before she gives a man access to her motherfucking body? It used to be a point in time where women actually value their innocence, actually value their virginity. But we do not live in that day to day, do we? Y'all want me to respect a woman's body more than she respected herself. So I, as a man, can prevent her from getting pregnant. Whatever a woman gonna allow me to do, I'm gonna do. Don't expect me to be irresponsible. Because if we both irresponsible, who's responsible for carrying a motherfucking child for nine months? It sure ain't no goddamn man. It sure ain't me. I don't got no remorse. I don't feel bad. That woman knew what she, she was doing when she laid down and slept with me. She knew the consequences. She knew the risk. And don't be trying to be like, oh, it's women with low self-esteem. It's women that, that's ghetto or ratchet or it's hood women. My seven baby mamas. And I don't even know why I claim them, just because it became a conversation. But some of them rich, some of them poor, some of them classy, some of them ratchet. Some got regular-ass regular, regular -ass jobs, some got great jobs. So it's a woman on all levels that'll fuck with a nigga like me. And don't even try to speak on morals and respect, because we don't have the same definition of morals and respect.
Stop trying to tell people they gotta hold me accountable or people like me accountable. The only person that can hold me accountable is my motherfucking self. Stop expecting men or women to come talk to me. I'm a grown ass man. I ain't gonna listen to shit you gotta say. And trust me, y'all think women gonna hear me talk and then stay away from me. They still gonna get this 8.5, trust me. So I do not feel motherfucking bad. I'm the most honest individual you will fucking meet. I do not have to manipulate no woman for no pussy, trust me.